invited to this event as influencers to promote the movie on our social medias and get the word out. And we decided to start blogging, blogging and Instagram at the same time. Yeah, but then it was like, how do we do this? We're gonna be having this a, Saturday. A we're having a brunch. brunch. So if You're you want to come and socialize, invited. meet new friends, so be inspired, eat good food, your spot whatever it is, whatever your reason, and we'll swipe up to there. RSVP and I'll see you there. I want this to be a group where we can rely on each other, where we can trust each other, and where it is a safe place to dream. As a contractor, I was doing a lot of work with galleries and artists, uh, but I found um, art to be powerful and, and therapeutic at the same time. And so I started making art and started painting. It's like the ultimate therapy. I just feel relaxed. It's like my happy place. I don't think I'm ever gonna stop paying. Sometimes I'll stay up all night and just paint. Just thinking about like what I want the painting to say. I just think about, you know, social justice issues, criminal justice system, like racism, like stuff that you know, that it's difficult for some people to sit down and really like talk seriously about, I can put it all into a painting. I honestly believe it has a lot to do with the people that are here. In Kentucky, it's almost like they don't like to give it up. I think that's one of the reasons why you have people that have um, been able to hang on for so long in areas that it doesn't make sense to hang on in. Maybe that's why we've hung on as long as we have in a way. I have literally not had an emotional breakdown anytime that I'm at a beach. So, I think there's a theme there. beautiful weather and there's just something about being out here that's like so relaxing to me and I feel good today. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> 
natin. Ah, ah. Ayan, marami-marami. 